has there ever been a problem, like when you've gone for an audition, the fact that you are Australian? Was anyone worried that you couldn't sustain the accent? Or? No, never, never. Yeah. Accents are something, uh, no, that's never been a problem. Accents for me are, um, I think because I'm, again, I use this term very loosely, I'm a musician. But I love music and I play music and I write music and it's it's um it's it's really it's just a something that I that calms me and, and you know something that I love and I've always treated accents like I treat music and um, I'm self-taught I know how to read music and um, so I've learned everything by ear and I have a way of hearing it filtering it and, and then doing something with it so I seem to do the same thing with accents. And something my um, it was it was a part of the curriculum at, at, at NIDA that I was I was I took very seriously. I took it hard very seriously. But I took I took accents very seriously and, and Betty Williams, who's one of the best voice coaches in the world, as far as I'm concerned. She said something to me once and she said I can't remember what it was, but it, it, it made me realise that for me, doing an accent isn't about the sound I'm making, it's about the thought process that happens before the sound. So if you're playing in America, Americans actually think differently than Australians. And Glaswegian Scots think differently to Americans. And Belfast Irish think differently, you know, so on and so forth. And so I believe you really have to find the essence of that, that, that people before you can make a sound. And so I, I try to be as diligent each time I come to a new accent as I was the last time. Um, more than anything, I mean, you don't want to look like an idiot uh, oh, <laughs> at, at the end of the day, but also because I feel that we have a duty to, you know, I don't mean to sound sanctimonious, but I just feel that we, if you're playing another, right, another sort of people, you, you have a duty to them to understand where they've been and where the sound comes from and you know, what it means to, to be. Be that. So um, no, I, I I usually go into the audition in, in the accent. Oh, you played that American the whole time? Yeah, yeah, I know, and it's not because I'm a fool anyone. It's just because it's the way I do it. And um, like August Rush, I went in in Irish. You know, when I did my auditions and uh, met everyone in Irish. And because that's the other thing, if you're meeting people in the accent, you really got to you've got to be thinking the way. And I, you know, differently because it's it's all improv. So.